Hello everyone, welcome to A Shadi Plays Minecraft. Welcome to the second episode of this series. Today we're going to be continuing off where we started on my brother Mafuz's house, which we started in the last episode. If you guys haven't seen the last episode, that the video link will be in the comment section below. So, why don't we get started? So, I already gave you guys a tour of my house and everything else in the I already give you guys a tour and everything else in the uh, last episode, so I'm not going to be doing that right now. But right now, we're going to be continuing on Mafuse's house. So this is my house compared to Mafuse's. We're going to try to make my house look just as similar as Mafuse's, but in the style that Mafuse likes. We're going to be opening this. I've made this big pillar which is very big and dark. So we're gonna be editing that today. But first I have to see the level of how much my house is down. Okay, I got it. So it's just one block down. So that's also what we're gonna be doing for Mafuse's house. Just one block down, just like that. Okay, so this is where Mafuz will be standing and doing everything he does in his new house. I'm gonna be finishing the flooring, but of course, I'm not gonna let you guys just watch me do it. I'm going to do it really quickly starting now. Okay guys, I finished it. Wasn't that really quick? Yes, and now look, see? Now Mafuz has everywhere just to stand and do whatever. Now, this part is gonna be his bedroom. Not only this part, I mean like the whole floor, which is very big and just like how mine was too. So that means we're also gonna be building on from here all the way to there. Again, I'm gonna do it really crap, really fast starting now. Again guys, I finished it really, really fast. Now Mafuz has all this space in his bedroom to do, again, whatever. We're gonna be, wow, just as we did that, now look, there's a lot of, uh, light so we're gonna be closing this up now we have finished everything of Mafuz's house we just gotta start on with decorating we're gonna start with bir birch stairs right there so that he won't really fall when he goes down wow that's good and then in this corner it's gonna be a kitchen so we're gonna be using black and white for the flooring like, have you seen in restaurants where if you ever got a pass to go to the kitchen, then there's going to be black and white checkered flooring? Yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing here. Right there. So it's going to be checkered. So and that's where it's going to stop. It's going to be a square, so... Is that a square? No, it's kind of, st it's still a rectangle, so... You're going to be doing that. Yes, that's a square. Next is the black concrete. Oh, I accidentally changed the white concrete to black. Okay. Okay, I'm done with the flooring. So let's go ahead and recheck the dimensions. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, seven by one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's a seven by six. But again, this needs to be a square, so it's gonna be seven by seven. So that's what we're gonna be editing now. There. Now it's a seven by seven. Now we can start with the furnaces and everything. So of course in a kitchen you have a stove, but in Minecraft they're called furnaces. So that's what we're gonna be doing. And of course you have to have at least one crafting table. 
So we're gonna be adding one in the middle, only cause they're not really that useful in craft in kitchens, but we're still gonna add it. We're also gonna add shulker boxes. Mafuza's favorite color is blue. So we're gonna be using a blue one. In my house, I used a black, not cause I used, not cause I like the color black, only cause it matches the flooring and everything. There, and then here we have more furnaces. Hold on, let me check the design I use for my house really quick. Okay, so if you guys can see, this is my design. I added little, what's this called again? Trap doors, birch trap doors on the bottom to make it look modern. I also added extra shulker, bo shulker boxes. It's a tongue twister. Then I also added some decorating flowers. I'm pretty sure Mafuz would like something else. Like maybe a armor stand for him. Or else he might put that in his bedroom. But I guess we might just put an extra one. Okay. We're going to have these shulker boxes. We're going to put it again on there. Okay, there. And then we're gonna add the trap doors. I'm pretty sure Mafuz would like these warped trap doors cause they're blue. Ugh, I always have to press shift and do it or else it's not gonna work. There, amazing, right? So we're just going to remove all these from my inventory because now we don't need them anymore. Okay, now I'm pretty sure the, the kitchen is finished, except I might add an armor stand. Yeah, I'm gonna add an, ar armor, sta an armor stand. <laughs> so here it is, it's gonna be right there. Actually, no, it might be right there aligning with that and then we're gonna have oh yes i totally forgot we also need a hmm i forgot the name of it it's it's kind of like a sink in minecraft you can also put water in it hmm we just have to search for it yes a cauldron how could i forget where should we put the cauldron i'm pretty sure we should just remove that and then put it right there. Let's put some water in it, this bucket. And then we could have a trap, we could have a crafting table right here. There, so then we could just do this. You could just shift and then use it like that, done. Okay, we have water in that. I think I'm gonna put some lanterns up, so because I can't really see in this, and I'm pretty sure you can't either. So, just one right there. Wow, that's a lot of light. Now it feels much better to see in. Wow, everything looks more joyful now. Now that there's light. So this is what we're gonna be doing. I'm not sure if, if any of you guys did this before, but I haven't done this in a long time. We're gonna need leather armor, a full stack. We're gonna need any color dye. We're gonna be using blue in this case. We're gonna be using blue, not light blue, only blue because that's my Fuse's favorite color. This is what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna dye the water blue. It's al It already is, but you know. And then, now we're gonna be dressing it on this guy. Same thing for this one. And then, what we're gonna do, we're gonna refill it, because no one is going to be drinking blue dyed water. That's unhealthy for you. And we're gonna be removing those. Okay, done. Now, Mafuza's kitchen is finished. Next is going to be the living room. I will be showing you guys the layout of my living room so that you guys can see it. So, oh wow, it's nighttime. Okay, I think I have to go sleep so that it can become day daytime.
we're just and this is the layout of my kitchen i added these um what's they what are they called like hanging things that you can hang and you can actually put food in it and then you could just take it out and then eat it just like a normal plate would now we have to go sleep i always need to p remember to put lighting in here because it is so dark during the night time and you know it's not really a good vibe having that there and i think i should also put some in the middle of the room it's very dark in there too i think that is enough Ladies now we can go sleep Good night. Okay, now good morning. I have three cats, Tuna, Olive, and Jenna. I might rename Tuna, but anyway, let's get back to work. Anyway, this is the layout. I have doors as for like the chairs and a, a birch wood slab. So it's gonna be the exact same layout as that one. Let's go in here. First, we need to get all of the all of the things we're going to need for it. So, birch door. Need a, a door, a slab, and a plank. We're also going to need a picture frame. Or a, just a frame, normally. Item frame. My bad. Not a picture frame, an item frame. And I'm pretty sure that is all. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Sure, that's all. So we're gonna be adding a slab right there, and then right there, and then one right there, and then one right there, and then right there. Okay, good. Oops, not right there. It's just gonna be like this. And then next is the door. Okay. Next, item frames. So whenever me and the whole family, which is Amir, Mafuz, and me, if we ever want to have lunch or dinner or breakfast together, we can just sit here. We could be sitting next to each other or, or parallel to each other or any which way or even perpendicular. So the kitchen is now done, which was very quick. Next is going to be the living room. But before we make the living room, we're gonna need to make the stairs. Just like that. It's gonna be facing this way this time, which is the opposite way. So we're gonna do it right there. Okay. Okay. Now, let's go ahead. Okay, now I'm gonna be finishing the stairs, but I'm gonna do it really, really quickly starting now. And now, I am done with making the stairs. Wow, look at them. Now we can just go up. And then this all will be his bedroom. Of course, we're gonna remove, we're not gonna remove those, but we're gonna add carpeting over it because, I mean, just look at them. Just sea lanterns, just spread a crowd, uh, uh, just spread across the whole bedroom is just not really a good thing so we're gonna be adding sea lanterns to make it good and we're also gonna add sea lanterns right here so that we can actually see in this place oh there's outside we're gonna be closing it up and I will definitely add windows just once I'm done with everything hmm, I should add some right here just there oh wait no not right there right there. The one right there. Okay. So, this is going to be the dining table, the kitchen, and then all this space will be for the, let's say, the living room. 
We're gonna be adding couches too. Oh, I meant to say, yeah, couches. We're gonna be adding couches, but they're gonna be made out of wool. Here they are. So it's gonna be facing this way. Okay. Huh, what's that sound? Hmm, I'm sure I just heard something. Oh, well, I guess it's nothing. So this is one couch. Hold on. Oh yes, that's how you make a couch. That's one couch. This is gonna be the other. There. Hold on, let me see the layout of mine again because I feel something is off. Okay, I see now. So it's two by two, not not three by two. Okay, I, I understand now. So to this, we're gonna be making a little change, just like this. Okay. Oh yes, and there's also a small space in the middle, so gonna be like that and then the door like that just like that that and then slab have that we're gonna be putting it just like that oh wait I made a mistake again okay just like this and then we can do this Add the doors. Oh wait, wrong direction. Just like that. And then now we can add the item frames and then now it's really done. Oh. There. Now we can add everything. Okay. This is gonna be one couch. I know I should learn a better way of making couches, but right now it's too late. Oh wait, hold on. I made the identical same. So we're gonna be removing this. It's so satisfying just to, you know, remove wool because the sound it makes is really good. Okay, so the TV. We're gonna be using black concrete for the TV just like this it's gonna be a maybe a four by two tv so one wait no oh black concrete one two three four one two three. or maybe a four by three wait no i think it was a three by two i'm pretty sure it was a three by two but a three by two is too small especially from sitting there so it's i guess it's a three three by four it is and then I also like adding trap doors to it. I'm gonna show you how. I like doing this. Oh wait, wrong direction. Okay, hold on. And then I like doing this so that I can really get the under part and then I'll have to rebuild it up after done so the TV is finished if I ever want to watch something I'm just gonna get a painting and then I would do oh no not not that this is what I would do okay first I would do this And then, now I would add a painting. Just like that. Okay. So I just have to make it in the correct direction like that. And then there. 
Anyway, guys, that is all what we have for today. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell to get more videos. Bye. We'll see you on the next episode.